Good evening to you, East Texas. I'm Christelle Phillips. Glad you're with us tonight. Lizzie Wallace's story has been an inspiration for the community for an entire year. Through her online blog, we got a glimpse, we got to take a glimpse into the 19-year-old's life as she struggles with a rare form of liver cancer. Now, at the end of her journey, Wallace had only one wish, and this morning, she got it. Our East Texas News 9's Michelle Reed was there to capture the surprise. This is so cool. <laughs> I want to keep it in my room. <laughs> Lizzie Wallace's contagious smile was like a ray of light this morning. As she got to drive to the pond for the first time in her brand new golf cart, thanks to anonymous donor. That made me really, really happy. Um, I'm feeling kind of sad just because my friends are at college and I'm I'm here. <laughs> For the past year, the 19-year-old Lufkin High School graduate has been struggling with stage 4 liver cancer, a cancer that keeps her from being able to walk for long periods of time. Miss Denise had said that something about getting a golf cart so that people could go down to the pond more easily because I tried one day in my wheelchair and it was is hard. <laughs> Denise Benefield, the director of the End of Life Care Center, Joseph's House, says all it took was calling a couple of golfers. I really could use a golf cart, and this is for what? And it's here this morning, you know, and there it is from an anonymous donor. For the past year, Lizzie has been blogging about her journey through her blog, The Life and Times of Grim Lizzie Papa. In June, Lizzie wrote on her blog, quote, More than a month ago, I was in the hospital dying. My doctor had to pull my family aside and tell them I had began the process of dying. We all knew it was coming. However, the golf cart will give the positive teen a way to find new inspiration. I would, I would like to fish. I'm very, very bad at it. <laughs> um, I was in environmental science in Lufkin High School. Uh -huh. We took us, Mr. Eubanks took us fishing, and um, all I caught was. Moss. And Benefield says Lizzie has incredible strength. I never see fear. I never see fear. I see strength in her. And she goes in and talks with these patients whether they can talk back or not. So she's just a very alive little girl. In Lufkin, Michelle Reed, KTRE, East Texas News 9. <laughs> Such a sweet spirit. And Lizzie says she loves the golf cart, but her ultimate dream would be to meet Anderson Cooper. And we are hoping we can help her dream come true.